Alright, hello everyone. Welcome to the match Templar vs Amnesia. This is the winner's bracket round 3. And I'm again joined by Nin. Hello, hello. <laughs> so the maps we will be playing is uh, Asylum 2, then CX Island, and if we get to the side or Bird City, Bird City of Ur. Of of O. Yeah, I don't know how you pronounce it. Uh, uh, <laughs> I have no idea either. You are I just say you are, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what it's meant to be. You're one anyway. Very old map, Boat City. Very old. I think it. Yeah. Just made within the first year of the mod coming. Or something like that. Buried. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. It, it's a really old one. Well, I have no idea because yeah, I started playing BT in 2006, I think. Yeah, I was about the same time actually. Um, I, think I just know a few bits and pieces, I guess. Or I guess a few bits and pieces. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I know an a an few things, guess. but yeah, indeed, at exact time when maps came out, it's not really. Uh, but I think um, this map and CX Island are quite a bit more modern. Yeah, the first one is. Oh, yeah, I switched to UT by the way. Yep. Okay. I was still showing the intro screen, and the screen is black. Well, well, at least you haven't made the mistake yet of streaming a penguin. <laughs> a, a final. Uh, um, that was just amazing what yeah, I did there. Yeah, one second. The screen is black for some reason. Okay. Um, hmm. I have no idea what's going on. Um. Right. How's it going? Um, I think I have to restart UT because it's not working once. <coughs> okay. Yep. Okay. I've I've an image now, so let's join the server. You were talking about the spikes in the skybox or something like that? Or? Yeah, like some towers or spikes, I don't know what they are. <laughs> yeah, it's just a text. That's kind of funny, yeah. Okay, well, we're ready to go. Just waiting on mats to click, and then we shall play. So this is third round of the winner's bracket. Templar defeated me to get to this stage, and oh yeah, defeated Rockstar to get here. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and they're voting for some reason. Uh, are they? Yeah, they've yep. not clicked yet. Oh, okay. Um. Yeah, it's because um, warm up mode allows mm. you to run around. So, oh yeah, probably got a bit confused. Yeah, maybe. It's 
So apparently Templar has cold fingers. Okay, nice. <laughs> yeah, and actually my my boiler at home has just like stopped working yesterday, so I'm also getting the same symptoms. <laughs> cold fingers. Yeah, well, I've, I've just turned on the central heating, so it's warming up here now. So that. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Okay, so here we go. Third round, winner's bracket. Templar versus Oya. Oh yeah. Oya oh yeah is uh, a previous one on one cup winner. Yep. He won the last one on one that was. Oh, that was close in Templar. He won the final one on one that was hosted on Clambase before Clambase went down. Yep. So some could say Oya oh yeah is the reigning Clambase champion. <laughs> and so you look at it. And. Um, Winning with a hilarious death from Dylan in the on area 51. Silly death there from Oya, missing the dodge in the second room. But yeah, Dylan indeed making an epic fail when Oya won. Cup. Templar, yeah, and the strangely shaped bar. It sometimes on bugs me a little bit. Yeah, it's a weird one. On the temp oh dear! He <laughs> Templar are taking too long at the buttons. Cratering on the drop. Oh yeah. Hasn't made a death since his first one. Going the quick way, not jumping on top of the By the way, oh Templar again, dead. Wow. Missing the dodge. Attempting to do the shortcut in the dodge room. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah Templar had a warp zone but uh, oh yeah had a warp zone bug. If you go down well, and fall, yeah. it's possible that your orientation is rotated by 90 degrees. Yeah, yeah, w when you drop, I mean, for me, the warp zone always gets me. It always spins me around, but I'm always ready for it. So, when you're dropping there, you need to make sure that you're ready to adjust your drop, because halfway down, um, the warp zone will move you around. But it looks like, oh yeah, wasn't ready for that. Maybe he's been training on a different server, I don't know. Yeah, it Maybe it, it acts differently. It always never gets me uh, as well, but... Yeah, I Check think it got, it got me once or something. So Pick up Templar now, by the way. He has an interesting technique here. Yeah, jumping on top. Yeah, I've yeah, never seen... That's how I do it as well. It, it's just so much more difficult, isn't it? Doing it that way. Um, I think it's safer. Well, the two times that I've seen him do it, he's looked very, very close to missing it. Wow, Templar doing exactly the same as Oya had the drop. What the hell's going on here? <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. But uh, both times as well that I've seen it, they they they're both looking like at the wall. They're not looking down. <laughs> I don't really understand. Yeah, if you look at the why. wall, then there's it's less likely that your uh, that orientation is changed. Okay, but it if really you look happens down, when you look down. Yeah, but, but if you look down, then you can adjust for it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I, I mean. <laughs> I mean, it's not a problem, your orientation changing, if you're ready for it, so... If you know about it, you might as well just look down and fix it. But anyway, um, both players at the same point now, yep. both approaching the drop. Both having um, trouble getting up. We go, Templar will make it first, see how he does it. Again, looking at the wall. Now okay, it's 180 okay degrees. <laughs> And oh yeah, had the drop. He's fine. So it was a fair game. Both players have died at the same spot in a silly way, so I guess it works out fairly that way. Yep. Mads approaching the spot for the drop. Not a difficult part at all. Oh yeah, only just behind him. This is an easier section of the map. It'll start getting more difficult again. Yeah, near the end. Next room. Yeah. So I've seen a few people dying here in previous cups. Oh, Mads has a... I didn't know you could do that, okay. Oh yeah, does it the intended way yeah, I missed of shooting. It. Well, Mads just stood at the platform and shot it without moving. Hmm. And then went... I didn't know you could angle the shot that way. So, Mad's still maintaining his lead, he's only about 5-6 seconds ahead. Oh yeah, and he's now approaching the flag room. 
missing the first shot there. I think people have died here. Yeah? yeah, this lift is, is tricky. Yeah. I mean, yeah. You need to be fast to make that. And it's annoying because, yeah. like... <laughs> wow, okay, this is 5 seconds. And it, yeah, 241, T46. But yeah, that, that flag room lift, it's like... When you do the last shot, you don't have enough room to do another dodge. So you kind of have to just run and jump. Or run and dodge. And it's really difficult sometimes to gauge when you should do it. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Down. Yeah. Temp template indeed. The first one uh, lift jump just normally, and the second one jumping around. Getting bugged by that bar. Yeah. See if the falls falls right now. Oh, that was close. So this is where oh yeah died, making the jump around this time. Templar now in the easy section of the map. Oh yeah, now at the drop where yep. we've seen both players die. Still looking straight ahead. Oh, I didn't see that one. <laughs> but if you check out Mads now, you're going to see the the shot that he does where he. Is it the unintended way? Just kind of angling that shot there. Yeah. Not having to do it in mid jump. Because if you miss the shot, can you get back? I'm not entirely sure anymore. Yeah, yes, you can. Yeah, it's just yeah. a simple dodge between those platforms. Um, it's a tricky shot though when you when you do it in mid air because you you can jump it, but it's a lot easier to dodge. And when you do a side dodge, it's more difficult to adjust your aim to shoot. Yep. So Mads, again, oh, okay, he hit that, he's in the flag room now, he just has to make this lift, and he will win the first map. Oh yes, approaching the fall again, but... No problem for him, this is a, a first map win for Mads. Armour 2.31, pretty good. Next map, CX Island. Yep, by Novus building. Novice Bunny, okay. Quite a bit of running at the start, but after that it's... Uh, yep. Quite a nice map. Yeah, it's a bit... The long one, it, it kind of reminds me a bit of Lethal Sun in the way that it is. I mean, a lot of the textures look the same. It's the same map. As on sure. Lethal Sun. Is it the same map maker? Yep. Ah, okay, well that explains it. And <laughs> explains CX it then. Island was first, and then he made Little Sun, so... <coughs> ah, I didn't know that, okay. Because, I mean, if you look at the lava room here, that it looks exactly the same as the lava room in Little Sun. Mm. At the beginning. But just the way that it's put together. Yeah, now I'm starting to doubt, but I, th yeah, I think CX Island was before Little Sun. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Lethal Sun has Lethal Sun's always been the preferred map of the two. In, in terms of cup history, at least. And Lethal Sun is in the map pool and has been in the map pool for the last two seasons, but it somehow hasn't been selected by random generation mm -hmm. each time. The X Island only entering the map pool this season and it was selected this time. Oh yeah, clipping his feet. Already gives a big lead to Mads because this map is long. Yep. Um, this is the CB version, right? It is, yeah. yeah. So there's no slime in the next part, you just water it. Or no, it's, it's long. Ah, uh, but it's less, taking less damage, I think. That was the right change. Uh, the Mads opts to use the. Um, Steam to push him down. You yep. can do that room without using the steam, which is the approach I usually take. 
Yeah, you can't do that on the original version, so I guess that's the change in the simulator. Okay, yeah. That's said, a slightly tricky bit here, doing these dodges. You yep. can hit your head and die there, but he makes it. Nice little trick there, I didn't know you could shortcut that. The man's now at the halfway point-ish. Using to do the... the right route. Slightly different from the left one. Oh, I think he's a bit slow though, is he gonna make this door? Oh yeah, he's fine. Oh, oh yeah, yeah also... Yeah, going down the slime at the steam part. You'll also use the steam. Yeah, uh, you're a bit quicker in a few parts uh, crouch while entering the slime as well. Mm. Makes it just... That's having a bit of trouble hitting this button. That makes it... Going down. So about one minute difference between the players. Tampa approaching what I think is the hardest part of the map, the lava room. Well, it's not that hard in my opinion, if you know where to go. Yeah, you just need to be careful if you, okay, he chooses to dodge that, you can do it a different way. Mm -hmm. Makes it just fine. I mean, uh, there is indeed a timer, but I think it's quite plenty of time though. So Mads will now approach the final room. Oh yes, making the he dodges. He will do the shortcut where he knows that he has a big lead. Oh no, yeah, but he doesn't know by how much, so he will do it the faster way. Oh yeah, just a normal way. There's indeed a lift that oh. uh, takes he you up. He actually shot those lasers a bit, a bit early, but he, he makes it. The Mads will make the first cap. Matt's informed us that I think on this version Cannon doesn't kill you, but I'm not certain about yeah, that. Yeah, I think that was fixed as well. There was indeed also a version in which it killed you. Matt's is just exploring the map at the moment. I don't know if you saw that. Nope. I was uh, watching, he's oh yeah, he's uh, just down the elevator. Yeah, Ma Matt's just... The lava room. <laughs> Before Matt's grabbed the flag, he just dodged up the mountains a bit and <laughs> played around. Standard stuff. So let's see how yeah approach this. Yeah, also goes for a dodge. I usually jump up to the point and dodge from that. Mm. Rather than using the slope. Both ways work. I'm assuming he will use the shortcut method. Almost misses that shot, but he does make it. And Mads now doing the slime room shots, hits them, he should make it. Oh yeah, in the flag room. Yeah, there should be a cap. Unless the Templar he has falls down somehow. Oh, <laughs> yeah, he's okay. I think you can get stuck in that piece of rock if it returns before you pass it. I'm not sure. Oh yeah, it's oh. actually slightly faster in terms of the run, but... Oh dear! I have no idea what just happened there, but Matt. Yeah, he did quite an interesting shortcut, and then indeed it has platforms. I think he missed the shot. What, well, no, I, I don't know what happened, because I, I only just switched to him when he died, but it looked like one of the platforms went down from underneath him. So it's like he just wasn't fast enough or something, I, I don't yeah, really know. Well, I don't know. Weird one. But okay, this gives... Suddenly, oh yeah, a lead in the map, and he's only about five seconds ahead. Yeah. Yeah, but if you look at the times, he is quicker. Yeah, by a small amount, he is. But I mean, Mads did fail in one of the rooms a bit, so... When he capped it. Okay, I get... A bit of complaints that, uh, that the stream is getting very grainy when there is a lot of movement. Yeah, I apologize, I just uh, had to install everything yesterday, so it was not entirely set up properly yet. 
Oh, oh yeah. You can't lose precious time. Oh, Matt has clipped himself at the orange electricity. We were talking about that just earlier. Oh. I think he bumped his head and clipped his feet on that. So it looks like Mads is contemplating <laughs> some weird shortcut, but okay. I've not seen that before. So massive, massive lead Royo now has really turned around much. It's always demotivating on maps like this and Lethal Sun and Slaughter when you when you die quite far through the map because mm -hmm. they're such long ones. But he's doing his typical thing now when. <laughs> When he dies once or twice in a map, I find Mads just tends to die consistently, always. Because he kind of tries to go into rush mode and... I don't know. Yeah, indeed. The trouble is, by, by dying loads and loads, he just gives... He gives Oya a lot more confidence now. Makes it a lot easier for Oya to finish the map when he knows Mads keeps dying. We should really just try and get a grip. Alright, I will change the settings of the stream after this map, I guess. Uh, I apologize for the inconvenience, but... <coughs> it's better than, than no stream at all. Yep. You're doing this uh, as a kind of last minute thing for us, so don't worry about it. Okay, so oh yeah, yeah, this is a good choice from him. Oh yeah, is now using the safe <laughs> lift. Very good choice, sir. That's uh, halfway through the map now, so if Oya doesn't die here at the electricity, yeah, he's got yep. it. He's got this it. is a map win for Oya, which means that we'll play a decider. The decider which being is buried, buried city. city. Yep. Well, Mads just kind of gave up then, yep. so... Yep. Alright, tier 2. And I'm going to restart the stream, so... We'll be right back. Okay, we're back. I hope it's a bit better now. Um, if any people on the stream... Uh, if anyone in IRC can confirm it's a bit better, that would be great. Uh, otherwise, I still have to make a small change in settings. How's it looking now? I have no idea. Well, if you're ready to go, I mean, if we should just go. I'm running short on time. Are you are you good? Uh, see, yeah, it looks like I'm okay. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. Apparently, not knowing the code at the in the map again or something like that. The secret room was removed in this version, right? What was... oh, you mean in the spawn room? Um, well, the... In different versions of the map, the, the secret room has been at different uh, places, so I don't know... <laughs> They switch sides. Uh, change scoreboard. Okay. Is the code different on each side? It is. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I can't remember. So it's been a while since I played this map. So 
So, this item map. Temple of Curses. Mm. Oh yeah. Some tactical shots yep. going on in the old version. You did used to be able to actually kill each other there, I think. Yep. A solar moon in this uh, cup. Solar moon is in this cup, yeah. So we can expect some tactical going in this cup again. We can expect some tactical <laughs> conks, for sure, yes. I'm at uh, making the lifts. Yep, so does OEM. Yep. Let's see much if we'll see the it? spike. Well, it's not really a shortcut, I think, but... Uh, Matt is known of jumping up the with the spikes. Yep, he's going for it. Yeah. Oh. 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 Here, there we go. He makes it. But so, what does that spike just doesn't kill you, or what? Um, it does, but um, the radius of the killing is a bit off, so there is a spot. Oh, oh, yeah, died. Yeah, I saw what happened there. He he hit the button and dodged immediately yeah. after he hit it. You have to wait a good half second or something and first. Templar. Missed a shot at the fall, so he just created. Did, did you see it? Yeah, well, his mouse got <laughs> stuck or something, so. Yeah, he didn't, he just looked down and didn't shoot at all. <laughs> That's weird. So both players at the beginning, Mads with a bit of a lead. Making it. But yeah, that's, um, that's an unfortunate death for both of them. It was. Oh, this one was a bit unlucky. He needs to remember that when he hits that button, he has to wait a fraction of a second before yep. he dodges down. Yeah, otherwise, you need to hit the mover. Yeah. Still dead. So, back to the lift jump for Mads. Yeah, but it's not even faster, I think. No, but, I mean, you might consider it to be safer. It, it depends on the method that you prefer. Some yeah. people can get crushed by that door as it closes. So. Maybe the spike does not kill you anyway, but b yeah, th the thing is there is, uh, on that bridge, there is a button in that room, yeah. and that button was the way to the secret room, but it's ah. really this version, I think. Okay, okay. So maybe it is intentional that you can lift jump up there, I don't know. Could well be, yeah. So maybe the, the map maker purposely put in a, a dud spike. So that you could do that. Mats has really unfortunate timing here, yep. so he'll have to wait. I think he reached it at the worst possible moment, which gives oh yeah a big chance to catch up a little bit. But let's see, Mats. He's going a bit early, I think. Mats, yeah. He, he might have a bit of trouble here, because that's not quite right there. Yeah, okay, he's made it. But oh yeah, also has to wait for a cycle, so it's fair in that regard. I completely forgot the timing on that mover though, on the teleporter. I have no idea what the correct timing is. You have to wait for it, to st it, it kind of, uh, it stops for a second uh, at one point in the cycle, and when it starts moving from the point that it stops, you wait a couple of seconds and then you go. Templar in the bouncer room. Yeah, looking good. I managed to die here. Oh, oh! It's very unlikely to die there, but it is possible. Well, the most important thing is that you need to make sure you don't lose health there, because if you miss one of the bouncers, you you can lose a lot of health, and you really need as much health as you can get for the yeah, last like room. Yeah. Because those cannons can really get you. Okay, let's see if he remembers the code. Yep, looks like uh, that. I still have to work it out. I haven't memorized the, the numbers, but... Oh, oh yeah, neglecting to hit the button. <laughs> there we go. The mad's approaching the fire room now. Nope, not getting hit. I might have to help out all year in this... Uh, <laughs> In this code room, we'll see, I guess. 
Okay, the uh, cannons were not really that active. Yeah, he got lucky though. But he had a hundred health anyways, so even if they were active, he would have been okay. But oh yeah, now in the uh, room, he's gonna check his console for the <laughs> for the code. Yeah, but still, the, the code is on the opposite side. Yeah. So, so he's forget that you can read it, but ah, uh, he's fine. He's he's. And this map looks very similar to Abydos, I wonder if it's the same map maker. It is, yeah. It, it is. is, yeah. Funny how you can kind of tell the map maker based on the style of his map. Oh dear! Oh yes, yeah, fallen down in the flag room. And he's dead. Uh, really silly, because he had a hundred health. I mean, he was in a perfect position to finish that and drops down and he jumps around instead of just dodging to the end and yeah a silly way sorry but the mads is set up he sets up the drop for himself he must have done all those shots at the end of his last run it's two of them this time he will have to wait for the mover Yeah, I mean, the, the this map is also by the same mapper of uh, Subtle Fallout, and uh, there is also a bit of resemblance between the, in my opinion, a little bit. Yeah. Mm, Subtle Fallout's a lot more modern though, isn't it? Like the the textures and the... Yeah, yeah. yeah it's more like Old Mill, it's but it is also the same mapper, so... <laughs> yeah, Old Mill, I can see. Being similar to stuff fall out, but not so much this one. But yeah, I find um, Templar's maps very recognisable. Um, I mean, whenever I see one of his maps, I just know it's his, even though I don't know. <laughs> you know, I think is a sign of a of a good map maker. Yep. And same for yours, actually. Uh, well, oh. Oh yeah, taking two dips, and he's gonna die. No, he swims no, out. He yeah, won't make he has it, to so. be very careful in the in the flag. Yeah, if he <laughs> gets there, because Templar is we are approaching the flag room now. Um, he's trolling a bit in the flag room. Mads, yeah, he's pur purposely taking a few hits there. <laughs> Having a bit of trouble with the dodge now. He's getting really lucky with these cannons, actually. He's fallen down three times there, and he hasn't been shot once. When I fall down there, I always get hit once or twice. So he's fortunate. Yeah, he will finish the map. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> So, right. four minute cap there. Okay. So, win for Templar. And uh, <laughs> who will he, f he face? Or is it not known yet? No, uh, he will face either Dylan or Special One. I'm not sure which... I think that match is being played right now. Yeah, I think so. I think Asterix is streaming it. Okay. So, that <laughs> is the end for this stream, and see you next time. Yep. Yeah.